Yo, 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 what's good? What's, what's really good with y'all? It's your boy, Dinell YG. Dirty Creek Sports, man. I'm back again with another episode of College Suits 2K8. And today we have another triple header. We have a uh, first game, Fresno State at home against Idaho State. Then we got Washington State at home against Air Force. And then we got Howard at Lo Loyola Merlin. So we have three great games today. Well, this possibly could be an upset or just another great game. Who knows what, what way it'll go. But, uh, yeah, like I said, we got three great games today because, like I said in the in the videos before, everyone's still feeling out their team. Everyone's still feeling out their strategy or, or the identity that they want to take coming into this season because it's a brand new season. A lot of great players recruited. A lot of great players coming in for next year. So everyone's trying to... Feel they self out and find an identity or whatever. But uh I'm just letting y'all know that today these these games will be the last games I uh record with the uh, bottom of the screen cut off because I'm, uh I, I found me some apps on uh on the app Mac that's good for the camera or whatever. Sound is good, you know what I'm saying? I don't think I feel like for real that needs to be uh changed. It's a video because the bottom of the screen is cut off as you see now. You can't really see what it says at the bottom of the screen but uh don't worry about that it, uh, a change is coming you feel me so uh we're gonna get into this first game this is my game fresno state versus uh idaho state so new new team for my eyes so here we go now with three and zero on the season on paper this looks like this should be a blowout and a run through. Hold up. <laughs> Hold up. You saw that. I don't care. Fuck that. I'm, just, I'm trying to learn my team first year. Excuse my language or whatever. But uh, and you still haven't turned the TV up yet. I'm looking at lips moving but no sound coming out the speaker. But anyway. Uh... Like I said, on paper, it looks like a blowout, but you never know. They might find the, the hustle and the heart to come in and pull off the upset and the win with a number team, number 10 team in the country. So we're trying to go out there and just basically prove ourselves to that. I just would like to say good afternoon, everybody. I hope you enjoyed your college football yesterday, because I know I did. Okay, now as they ran down how they feel about the game today, you see the starting five for both teams. Now, they gave my center a lot of praise, and I was talking about, about this yesterday in the games yesterday, that my center, Khalil Ball, let me tell you, he can get the job done for the big man. Big Roy, there we go. But uh, I was supposed to did the podcast this morning, right? Please forgive me because I was up all night watching the games and forgot to set my clock, actually. But uh, you will get the podcast tonight. So you'll get the podcast tonight, whatever's going to be the topic tonight, because that'll be good. I can get everything together because I forgot to get all the topics and put them, uh, my stat sheets and everything and the teams that I want to go out there. So, yeah. I'm in my freshman year. That's me right there, Darnell Mason Jr. 
in my freshman year. Doing good so far for my first three games. All three games average double figures. He gets the second to fall as well. Ball inbounds the ball. Page feeds it to the wing. Ah oh, man. Mason Jr. Nice little crossover. There we go. Ah. Great way to come off the screen, though. And it's still not Thought it was going to go in, but I guess not. Let's check sideline reporter Tracy Wilson, who has some info for us. Thanks, Vern. A little while ago, I talked with Coach Jackson. He told me that they want to use their quickness to their advantage. He said they couldn't think of another squad that could match their team's speed, and he wants to make sure that shows tonight by way to close out on the deep. showing how fast this game can be played. Guys? Thank you, Tracy. Nice work by the big fella to get that rebound. Ah, yeah. The whistle for blocking, and that's his first foul of the game. Definitely a block. Just got a little too physical trying to draw the charge. Walker. Walker inbounds the ball. Has it. Right wing. Oh. Just missed it. No three point opportunity. Now, as you know, we went 0 10 for free throws yesterday. That's because the controller I was using was kind of messed up. You know what I'm saying? So right now I'm using the PS4 controller. So let's see how better we'll do. This is the first okay. Bennett to make his first stand off the bench. What? I don't know what the hell is going on, but uh. Oh, yeah, I forgot to change the. Ah, uh, they were. I like how he gets himself into defensive He position. still made the basket. I'm like, why'd you stop the shot? To the free throw line. You good. Ball. Inbounds the ball. So we're just taking it slow on these fools. Four, three. Like I said, we're taking it slow on these fools. Up by three. But at the same time, we're going to find our niche. Swings it to the wing. To run well. Passes it to the wing. To run well. Fires the three. Here's the rating. Keeps it alive on the offensive end. So you gotta be strong on that on that rebound. Man. He can live with that miss. He was open. I see you. There we go. My dog KB Ball. You know what I'm saying? Back with the uh with the putback for the all for, for the uh pass. Great pass from Page. Ah, and they call for the reach in. And that's his first foul of the game. He should concentrate on just getting good position instead of flailing away at the ball like that. Mencia, Make him feel uncomfortable. Hopefully they know the principles Mencia. of a two three. Karunga jumps it off. Shoots the three. Ball pulls it in. About eleven and a half minutes left in the half. Page dishes it to the top of the key. Dumps it to the inside. Raises up. There we go. There in front, 13 to 6. Johnson. Karungwa gets it. Right wing. Good shot. Netted for three. It's shameful to give any guy on the floor that good a look. They got burned. Damn. But I know if you were my dad, you'd get to my own. My bad, y'all. It's, it's like, 
Johnson. Grab that rebound with his elbows high. Using a little intimidation. The charge word, but it's, 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 it's loose. Bennett beats it to the right wing. To the free throw line. Dishes to the high post. I'm staying with him. Ah, you gotta put some more. Wilson, put some more body down in right that paint. Ten minutes left in the half. Swings it Cash. to the wing. <laughs> it's okay. We are gonna make that. Like I said in the videos before, my objective of my team for this year is to shoot more, shoot more three pointers. Like shoot 20, 20, 23 point shots a game. You know what I'm saying? To see how good we are shooting the ball. For it. It off. Catches it. Left side. Gets a piece of There we go. Defense. Great help from Paige. Let's see what he can do. <laughs> Uh-oh. Real Walker with the shot. Six points. The Idaho State coach saw something out there and didn't like to make sure that everyone is working together out there. So, four-point lead. Fresno State. We up five. We're well, up four. My bad. Excuse me. They called the timeout. They see something they didn't like. Okay, that's cool. But that just gives us... More firepower to come out there and shoot at will and rebound tough, rebound hard, get into the paint, look for the open man, fresh legs, type type things like that. Man, that coffee tastes good. Type of things like that, you know what I'm saying? Whatever, because if we're going to win this game, <laughs> we're going to have to come hard with the defense and with the offense. Seems like they limited us to a few possessions, but it's cool. So we're going to go back to our original defense, 1-3-1, one, one, and see how much that's going to work. Mencio inbounds the ball. Side. It's all about the rotation. Leads him with the pass. Some Jack Johnson. <sighs> and they're now behind by two. Right around nine minutes left in the half. Walker lets it go. No, shit, no foul. It's cool. They increase their lead to four. We got great facilitators out there. This should help them pressure the ball all the way to half court. Leads him with the pass. He gets the board inside. I love the defense. Just because he's in tight doesn't mean you have to give up the easy deuce. Man, Black. Wilson with the floater. See, that's his game. See, that's his game. He can beat you off the dribble if he pump fakes. Feeds it to the wing. Grabs, gets it, right wing. The last shot missed from three-point range. Oh, the big fella with a tough rebound. No denying him on that one. Swing pass, right wing. So he can beat you off the, uh, off the dribble if he pump fakes. Uh, he wanted the jumper. He wanted to show he had a jumper, but I guess not. Look how the defense is closing out. Even if we're, even if we're out of position, even if we're out of position, plan, uh, whatever uh, defensive set we're in, we still recover and rotate. Let me tell you, that's the only way a defense will stay alive if they recover and rotate. Come on. With a chance for a double-digit lead, catches it right wing. Johnson has it. So it looks like we're not gonna 
shoot many three, will make many threes tonight. You see, I was there for the defense, though. Right there. But it's recovered by Bennett. Down Look at the hands. Hands high like church. <laughs> hands high like church, my man, with the block. Where you walking with the block? You see them dudes out there? Hands high like church. Hands high like stoners. Whichever one you want to use. But I like church better. You gonna give him the shot? It's up to the coach to put the right people in the right places. It didn't happen there. Oh, James Page, four points. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. They go with the timeout. They feeling a little uneasy. It was just a four-point game. Now it's 10 points. So the question is, in that huddle, what are we going to do when we come out next? A lot of people don't have, probably don't have the answer right now. They're probably just telling them stay. Just stay grounded defensively. Stay in their face. Keep a hand up. Get those guys get those guys a little on edge. But huh, even if we play uneasy, <laughs> look at Eddie, though. Really, though? Rodney crazy. But even if you get these guys on edge and a little uneasy, they're still going to come out and bring it to you. They're going to put it in your chest and just out. Give it to you. Nothing but body shots. You're going to have to eat these. A lot of these shots and a lot of these buckets that they make, you're going to have to eat them. Like, like two boxes going at it. Boom, boom, boom. You're going to have to eat these punches. But sooner or later, you're going to have to punch back and swing back. God, both of us, we matched up. He's just a little bigger than me. I'm nothing but a skinny frame. Let me tell you. Skill set, he don't match with mine. Shot clock Let me tell you, I would have took his ass off the dribble. Snatches it down inside. Like this. The Bulldogs looking to extend their run. Nah, move, 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 move. The fuck? Mason Jr. takes the shot. Ah! Oh! Almost had to and one. Love and grand design. Some people say it's even harder to find. Took him off the dribble. Almost got the and one. Can't sink the first. So. Yeah, I think I need to just give me another PS3 controller. <laughs> See, look at that shit. I don't know what it is. But uh, if, I, if I ain't mistaken, uh, I'm going to have to turn that free throw uh, shit up. <laughs> they miss, they miss, they make, they make. But I'm like, bro, y'all y'all talk about something. They cut the lead to eight. Talking about some bad release, and I didn't even release the jump yet. Five and a half minutes left in the half. Uses the crossover. Block. Evans Miller. Evans Miller with the hand one. But you see, they'll make the shot. Or when I use the trigger, they'll make the shot. But I think second half, I'm going to go back to the PS3 controller. And that'll give them the three-point chance. Let's watch this. Let's see what Evans Miller do in the free throw. See what I'm saying? I didn't even release this shit. Oh, there you had time. I'm about to change this stuff. Sorry. But, uh, y'all ain't got to believe me. But I'm, I'm, I'm talking some real shit. I, I did not even. Ah, uh, that's the second one. I didn't even release it. 
talk it over with us and we'll take. If you've got the time on to, you might as well use them. You can't take them to but the that, bank. But see, whole, whole time, that was the whole thing. Did you break everything down? Oh. It's right here. It's, that's the whole reason why I, uh... Because it's a big-ass nug left. That's the whole reason why... I, oh, shit. Yeah. And I ain't got time for the shit to keep doing that. That's the whole reason why I switched it up. Because I'm like, bring Walker back in. Because I'm like, I'm not afraid to make a free throw. So... Until I give me another PS3 controller, I'm gonna have to put the, the free throws up. I mean, they're gonna miss some, make some, but hopefully. Hopefully, I, I to the, it's to the point where it it, 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 it overrides the, uh, the ability of the AI. Oh, yeah, that. Uh, my bad, I'm so sorry. That it overrides the ability of the AI, so. So we're up 10. We're hurting on the free throws because of the control. I lied to you now. Let me tell you, I'm a free throw whiz. Check. Matter of fact, if you don't believe me, check any of those other games. When I played with Towson, matter of fact, because those are the only ones I stream. Those are the only other games I stream. Ah, come on. Charlie Gray. You're back. You can see. I shoot that free throw shit like it's money. Like it. Look at that. These people are loving it. You think it's getting louder here or what? Crosses it up. The jumper was Like, I believe that if he gets a if he gets a mid-range jumper. He'll be NBA talent. He'll be NBA. NBA ready. A group substitution. Oh, you can't come across the body like that. That is a textbook reach. Skim. He'll be NBA ready. It's like he has defensive ability. He has the defense. He can. He he has the. Uh, he can rebound. He can get to the basket. But uh, he's like a uh, Andre Iguodala with no no jumper. A lot of people would say Andre Iguodala. Has a jumper. Let me tell me. I will. They say Andre Iguodala. My bad. A lot of people say Andre Iguodala has no jumper. No, he does. Y'all going off. However, he shoots on NBA 2K. This and that. That man. Nah, that man has a jumper. Whereas if they didn't, he wouldn't have won uh, Finals MVP uh, about four years ago. But they're still behind by 12. Six years ago, might be. Six or uh, five or six. Oh! But you see what I'm saying? He has to run that. That's my fault. Can't convert. There we go. Mason Jr. is needed out on the floor. He didn't get much of a rest. Evans Miller. We're trying to get our bench as much as as experienced as we can. Ah, cash money. We're trying to get our bench. Like I was saying, we're trying to get our bench as much as experienced as possible because uh, come tournament time, it's always going to be that one guy on that starting five that can't step up in a certain game. And, and oh, good block. Royale Walker with the block. He has two blocks in the season. Ah, you got to make that blood. Yeah, it was a much quicker shot, but I feel like we have the cushion to take it. Ah, let me get that. Let me tell you, give us cushion, we're going to get the pushing. Give us nothing, huh, we're going to get the touching. 
Uh-uh. Ah. Oh, they gave it to me. They gave it to me. Oh, I'm shooting 75%. I did not know that. I did not know that. I only missed one shot. Thank you for, for, for that, God, Jesus Christ. I ain't religious, but I'm very humble and spiritual. Johnson, beautiful rebound. Fox his man out and never let him regain position. Here we go. Ah, he misses. The the there. It's all good. Sometimes they miss those, sometimes they make those. But uh, I wasn't counting on uh, counting on me make and well actually counting on me missing. Excuse me. They're down 16, Johnson. they're trying to come back. They're now behind by 16. 122 left in the first half. Mason Jr. Carter. Oh, he mouthed him. Please sign that. You got to sign that. All right, let, he got to sign that. Look at that. Look at the defense and the paint. They say if you play the 1-3-1, one, one, you must have a great defensive presence in the paint. DJ Evans Miller is just that. Like, did you just see every time we ran the one three one? If you go look at the beginning of the season, if you see some league in there, oh, will he get this one? <laughs> it's up in there, <laughs> like an enema, fool. But uh, <laughs> if you look at us when we play the one three one, and DJ is down low, let me tell you, he's a quick big guy. No homo, pause, whatever. He's, he's a big guy that's quick. Because he just got two blocks already within the past three, four minutes. One, three, one. Let's play it again. You got, they say you have to have it. See, look. He's right there to close out on the defense. They say you have to have a quick big man. You have to have a, I see you. Fire oh, that shit. <laughs> I think I am. This could be even further out of reach. We need to make some adjustments. Now we'll bring you our player of the head. Who's your pick? This nigga Bill? little Nas X is. Let me hold my thoughts and my tongue. I don't want to sound like I'm. Um, um, yeah, I'm hate speech or you know, gay bashing or nothing. But it's just that I grew up in a certain era where that shit was a uh, no fucking go in my house. So sorry. I'm gonna just keep my mouth closed. But uh, since we in the locker room right now, I gotta uh, drain the main vein right quick, and uh, I'm gonna come right back at y'all. Give me like a, like 30 seconds to a minute. Okay, everybody. Now, welcome back to the Dirty Creek Sports Halftime Show. Now, we're sitting here going over the negatives, whatever, for uh, 
Fresno State. And uh, they say they aren't scoring off fast break. That has to be a point for them. But like I said last game, the reason they aren't scoring off fast break is because they're not giving them much to work with off the fast break. They want them to hit the boards harder. They, they're not hitting the boards harder because why? They're getting defensive stops and turnovers. Our bench is tight. Okay, that's cool that your bench is talented. Let them go deeper. But you want to keep the legs fresh for a tournament time. Let me, a, a lot of guys, these guys can't play, but let me tell you. If tournament time come or midseason come and you need someone to run the, run, run the offense because one of your star players are hurt or main players that the offense has ran through, then you're not going to have nobody doing tournament time because I've seen a lot of injuries plague a lot of guys. And then it doesn't just plague a lot of guys. It plagues, it plagues the entire roster. So, okay, we're pressuring them but not causing much turnovers to use more. Okay, that's cool, but... They're already getting turnovers. It seems like they want this team to be perfect because they see the perfection of the other team that they have and that they can use. And that's a good thing, but you don't want to, like I said last video, you don't want to use up too much of your energy. And uh, had these guys out here hurting for their lives and, and, and uh, NCAA uh, uh, tournament or the conference tournament. Okay, so we here with the box score and the stats. I what I see I see I see something that I'm gonna mention to y'all on my podcast that Fresno State they're doing it but not too much of it and this will be a key to help them win every game and not fall behind. But as you see, equal amount of numbers, equal amount of minutes for their starters and for their bench. They're doing good. They're looking good. They're just trying to slow the pace down until it's time to break it open. Ball has two. Normally by by last game, by halftime, he had ten, he had twelve points by now. I knew I uh, caught a whiff for something. But, uh, yeah, I'm like, hold up. <laughs> Man, anybody got an incident? <laughs> sure, it ain't that good. But, uh, as you see, the total numbers, you can do the percentages in your head. Five fouls, I mean, that's not good, but it's not bad because it's like every the five fouls come from one play, so secretly spread it out. No one guy's in foul trouble or anything, but it's just that they could lay off or lay off of some of the aggression, but that's how they play, but it's cool with them. If that's how they play, then that's how they play, but don't let it get you in trouble. Checking out Idaho State. Checking out their uh, their stats. Seeing how good they play. But it's a, if you see, it's a 20-point game. Actually, they created a, a manageable deficit that can be chopped down. You know what I'm saying? I call it the uh, the uh, the Paul Bunyan or the George Washington or the John Henry. Syndrome. All you gotta do is get in there, put in the hard work, get the swinging, get the chopping, hit it directly every time. You know what I'm saying? You can't tire out, you can't gas out, you can't waste any time either. You gotta go in there and just bring it to them. But let me tell you, the defensive intensity for Fresno State, it's not gonna stop at any time soon. These guys are gonna bring it to your head, bring it to your neck, and any other part that they see that they see vulnerable. They're like a mountain lion. I see somebody. 
that they know's not from the from they part of the earth. Whatever. Let me tell you. The keys for for Idaho State to get back into this game and to win it is the three-point shot. And rebound. But uh we're almost done with the halftime. We're actually done. So we're gonna get back. Like I said, we're gonna switch the control over. And we're gonna get back to the game. Steve is a fool. Huh? Why you good? Huh? No. Nah. I wouldn't be surprised. Okay, so. Okay, so. This is the lineup I'm going to go with. <clears throat> Crazy. So this is the lineup I'm gonna go with, and uh, like I said, switching over the controllers. Hold on, let me connect it again. Really, Steve? He over there daydreaming like shit. Gonna get his little bony ass. Oh shit, wrong controller. I mean, wrong cord. I know. You probably say, come on, dude. This shit take it too long. Fuck you if you are. Kiss my ass, nigga. I don't give a fuck. Turn off the controller right quick. There we go. And like I said, I'ma uh I'ma switch up the sliders. Boy, where's the free throw? Oh, I know where that shit at. That's in gameplay. I don't care if you say, oh, yeah, man, they kiss my ass. Fuck you. I love my sliders, nigga. It keeps me from getting blown the fuck out. <laughs> if I'm going to get blown out on some on some okay sliders, then I'm going to just get blown out on some okay sliders. Fuck that, nigga. You think 65 is good? Uh, I'm gonna go with 65 for now and see if that's good. If that's too good. I'll take it back We're down to 60. To the but uh, here we go. Can you feel me? Like I said, that's the only reason. Hey, you got the lighter? Like I said, oh, I got it in my pocket. Like I said, that's the only real reason why I didn't. Uh, I switched over to the PS4 controller because, man, the goddamn... Tracy Wolfson has more on what went on at halftime. Tracy? Well, at halftime, I talked with Coach Jackson. He I couldn't even see the basket the <laughs> or really see his shot. In a way to make sure that man, that shit will block your vision. to say that he is going to break all the conventional wisdom and blaze his own path this game. We can expect to see some strange practices coming up. Back to you. Well done, I see Tracy. what it is. Man, I got to pass the ball just like I figured out last game. I got to pass the ball around. No, I'm not doing that. He intercepted. Ah, come on, blood! You gotta go up for that. Like, like Paige would have got up in the air for that. He would have statue of liberty. That shit. This is it down low. Ah, good one, boy. Too strong. Slow it down.
passes to the wing. Ooh. That was like a a, 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 a VD shot in your ass. <laughs> It, 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 it's for something spicy, but it cleared it right up. Come on. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Carter got eight points. Like I said, he runs my second team offense. So he's the sixth man. So he's making about 11 points a game. So I'm trying to I'm trying to get him to win sixth man of the year. If not, he'll, he can win the next year. He didn't have a lot of room out there, and it kept him from getting comfortable on that shot. Goes up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. Oh. I'd love to see that. He was looking around then. Oh! He surprised the shit out of me. I know we ain't supposed to cuss on national TV, but I don't give a fuck. He surprised the shit out of me. <laughs> but look how they work together, bro. I love that shit. I love that shit. It's like two sticks on the grill, motherfucker. I love that shit. Yes, I love that shit. He like, give me more, feed me more. Ah! Ooh, he feeling it. He feeling it. He wouldn't have took the three-pointer if he wasn't. He, uh oh, uh oh, Dicky V just called him. What you say? Hey, this kid is awesome, baby, with a capital A. Like the way he just went up for the ball, it just amazed me, baby. Like I said, it was Danny Duncan Rule. Hey, okay, baby. <laughs> oh! Ah! Look, do you see that, baby? This is straight from Dicky V, baby. I love this game, baby. It's he double A. This is the tournament, but this is in the conference center, but this is the regular season. I'm sitting here to my guy, Brad Nessa, and it's saying, okay, baby. I can just keep saying I love this game, baby. Let's go, baby. Can you get me off the line? Because I keep saying the B word. What is that word? It's A-OK, -okay, baby. Let's go. Hey, uh, we out there turned up for the second half. <laughs> huh? Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. Yea, I'll walk through the valley of the shadow of death. I shall fear no evil. And I hope that with the message I just got, the news I just heard, don't rape me, don't make me rip these goddamn headphones in half. Oh, I ain't gonna break the TV because I'm playing my game. But uh, it's cool. Just let me know when you come back. But yeah, though, like, huh. I just made sure she leave me something in her wheel. <laughs> I'll be good with a few thousand. I love her, but uh, that nigga hurt. You feel me? We need transportation. <laughs> That's all I got to say. I have a license now. <laughs> but uh, as you see, we just came out had time. We just went on the run for the last four 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 minutes and fifty nine seconds. For four minutes and one one second, whatever, nigga, I'm high. As you see, Dicky V just got on the line and expressed how he feel. So, uh, let's get back to this. The Bulldogs are making substitutions. I hate that Johnson they do that shit. Inbounds the ball. The Bengals have got a lot of ground to make up. Next Friday is tagged with the reach, and that's his first foul. The Bulldogs will get a few starters back out on the floor. It takes quick hands to get the theft, and he was too slow that time. Yeah, I'm great. My bad. I almost forgot about you. 
You have to protect the lane, and that time they tried to sneak one through on him. The big guy has spoken. Uh, yeah. You don't know if that rain will come down. You have to protect the lane, and that time they tried to sneak one through on him. The big guy has spoken. So you gotta protect that back door. Oh. Alright. Shoots. Collected inside the ball. Up in the KB ball has six points already. Well, I can't say already like it's the first half. Oh, and the, and, and the Bengals with the turnover. Idaho State needs to fight a little bit harder if they're going to come back and win this game. Because let me tell you, that run we just seen coming out of halftime, huh. it's only going to get worse. Inbounds the ball. Page way up court. Gets it on the elbow. Gray. Oh. See what I mean? Shooters who can exploit the defense. But it's recovered by Johnson. The Bengals are really struggling. They need to. Karungwa passes it to the right. Right wing. Lead pass inside. See, look. By Johnson. You might as well say our team is complete. Gray. Make some mistakes. Oh, good, 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 man, look at that. Great shot IQ off the dribble and find his spot on the floor. He was like, forget just trying to take it. I'm going to just try to score the easy way with no one in my face. Because if I get down to the basket, then someone's going to be in my face. And I'm going to have to try to try my best and my all to score the hard bucket. The hard, but inside. easy bucket. Down you tell you, sometimes the jumper with no one in your face is an easy bucket boards. like that. You didn't make it, but sometimes that's the easy bucket. A rare occurrence. As long as you keep running your offense, the coach will forgive a few clunkers. Goes up. <laughs> well played by Evans Miller. Quick defensive reaction changed the trajectory. That's what great defenses do. Contest every shot. It's Damn, I thought he was going to come under the bucket. The pass, oh, you trying to get fancy on him? The Bengals will try to put a stop to this run. I think I'm going to really convert shoot. Carter to a shooting guard. Get the jumper to fall. Well, you can't fall him for taking that this shot. This is like the road that I wanted to take on. Him such an you, open look. There we go. Good shot. See, he's just trying to find his shot. He'll find it. By second, by next year, he'll have it. I thought he was gonna move. There we go. Swish by 35. Stolen by Page. Oh, Charlie Gray with the 11 points. They're leading 61 to 24. I think it's time that they could go deep on a bench because, like, let me tell you, this game is over and out of hand. And I'm going to call it right now. It's done. Might as well get, a, get, get some players who's not going to play this season. Some. Oh, my Jesus. <laughs> I think they should just put some players in who's not going to play the season. But let me tell you. But let me tell you. Yeah, they hit the first three games. It's been blowouts except for the first game, the Colorado State game. But let me tell you. That game, it, let me tell you, these games are only get better. Good way to take it. Let me tell you. They only get better. Because you want to know why? A tough double clutch layup there by Karengla. But they're still down by 36. Fresno State has had serious problems with their interior defense. And Tracy has a report from their bench. Coach Jackson is definitely aware of that problem. He they only get better because this is just tune up more of games. They schedule these games. Dunbar Jackson schedule these games so they can play against guys. It, it, it can be a real game, but they also how to they they, they, they learn the techniques and skills and how to play the game in a real game. 
not against a good opponent, but in a real Johnson. game. So they're tuning up their skills and tuning up their uh, tuning up their skill set and they uh, whatever weapons that they have to make them great players. Because let me tell you, Green fights into the paint and yanks it down. Passes to the elbow. Karungwa. Let me tell you, when they get down to the nitty gritty Passes. conference time. Converse play. I think that it's going to be curtain. And you can see it in the result. Hey, puts it up. It falls short. But they still lead by 36. I think. Takes it up. Oh, he gave it to him. Beautiful pass. Led straight to the layup by Johnson. The Bulldogs take their first time out of the game. I think that they'll only play much better. Fresno State. I don't know if you heard that. That was a controller dropper. I think they'll only play better. And the reason I say that is because they're already playing at a high level beginning of the season. They're averaging 96, 93 to 96 points a game. What will they, what, will they uh, throw down in this game? We don't know, but they're 66 and six minutes left. So they need about 20, 23 points to get uh, to nine. 24 points to get to uh, about 24, 25, uh, about 30. Yeah, about 34 points to get 34, excuse me. 34 points to get the 90 something. So, the reason I'm counting because I'm like, they're going to run that shit up fast, bruh. Bro, they're going to run that shit up fast. Best believe that. to finish up and come out the break this has been a good game so far even though it's been one-sided but it's been a good game because we're getting to see the, some of the best of, of the Fresno State basketball that's that's about to come this season and the inbounds the ball McBride goes up and that's what we hope to see and that's what we want to see the best of what they can do but let's just see they look like they're by themselves the rest of the guys that don't play in but that's good like I said they'll get the same game experience that Carter, Mason, Walker, Ball, Wilson, great. Those guys, Page, those get those guys have been getting for the first well, these are the first four games of the season. Even summer league and and, and, and preseason. These are some guys that didn't see a lot of a lot of action. See a lot of game action, so let's see what they're gonna do. But I would like to see them go back to to letting uh, Carter run the first offense, first first uh, the, the uh, second team offense as the starting point guard. So they're going to get back on their defense. <laughs> Look at Wilson, man. He re Wilson was ready to press somebody. Look at no good on the man, look at the up. defense down low. Leads him in. It's tipped. Ah. Idaho State is shooting itself in the foot That's with my foot. all Fuck. the turnovers. Tracy has something for us. The Bengals coach looked downright disgusted after that last turnover led to yet another opposition bucket. He yelled three simple words at his guys go. on the floor. Protect the It's all good. We got a lot of big men. See, but forget it. I'm gonna say it like this. See, as you see, all our big men, we're not afraid. They're not afraid to go up and to take it back up. Because let me tell you, a hard bucket is, looks more prettier than a jump shot, baby. Anybody can make a jump shot, but not everyone can make a hard bucket. Walker with the shot. Four assists. Ah. 
It's pulled in by Flowers. And that's his fifth rebound in this one. Wow. He's been Four assists, three steals. Like, he's well-rounded, let me tell you. And I can't believe it. The last time we seen this type of basketball was from Adolph Rupp. Oh! Back when they lost the championship game to uh, Texas Western. To the elbow. Karungwa backs down. Bounces it to the top. I guess of the he team. didn't think five Negroes Bennett. could be his his five five white boys. Clark I'm not gonna say no racial slurs or nothing because that's not what that topic is about. It's about Butler never judge a book by its cover. Ball. Even against an average score, the defense okay. has to be more aware. Absolutely, Vern. Skip pass. Baseline. Mason Jr. Walker. Oh. Hey, line. let me tell you, if he get that three pointer together, man, let me tell you. But they're still out in front. By It'll be SWAT team out there. That's a good headline for these guys. A good nickname for this team. SWAT team. <laughs> oh my Jesus! I wish I could have finished. Wish I could have, would have, but I didn't. Oh! Come on! <laughs> Look at the pass, blood. Four points. I thought he had more than that. Five assists. To the free throw line. Feeds it to the top of the key. Uh oh. Raises up. Out of 30 point, 30, 20 point, 20, 20, 30 point games over for Mason. He wasn't too worried about that one. Gave him room to Damn. Ooh. Oh, my God. Like, what happened? Like, what happened? <laughs> like, what happened? Like, we're getting it together on the defensive end, but I'm like, what happened? Oh! Good defensive IQ. Because who knew to recover? Who who would have knew to recover right there? Bennett releases from 16 feet. Wilson grabs the rebound inside. That's the shot you work for, Bill, even though he's not their number one option. The uh -oh. defense will have to show him some respect because he will hit that given another chance. Bennett skips it to the paint. The last shot laid in by Clark. Uses the teardrop. And oh, what a move, Vern. Left wing takes the shot. Damn. <laughs> That's because we're not moving the ball. We're just passing it one time and then shooting it. Get up on him. Don't let him get behind you. Dumps it to the inside. Karunga good way to close out. Raises up. Can't connect in long range. What a good job on the defense to make him think about that shot. Tip. And it's controlled by Idaho State. Such great instincts. He knew exactly where the ball was going. I wanted to make sure that back door was secure. That's why I moved like that. Oh! Mason with the defense, but he couldn't get there in time. But they still he feels some type of way. Yeah, he feels some type of way about that. Takes a three. He felt some type of way about that. Let me tell you. He felt some type of way about that. Mason Jr., look. He's perfect from three-point line. So I think that uh, the rest of his shots should be just uh, two-point shots. They play basketball like a church choir. Hands up. But that's how you coach defense. Hands up. Mason Jr. with the crossover. No, no. Oh, 21 points, seven assists. Didn't get a double double, but it's okay. 60%, 100 from three point. That's cool. You know what I'm saying? Oh, let me show you how it's done. Nah, don't fuck it up. All right, just, just hold it. And we took it. 83-44. That is game. That is our fourth win on the season. And I'm proud of us. Ah, look at my man. How he tried shaking bake. He wanted to show him his prettiness. 
But that's it for this game. Next game is Washington State, and after that is Howard. Twenty-one points, five assists, four steals, and he's only a freshman. Now let's go to Greg Gumble back in the studio for today's Pontiac game-changing performance. Hi, and welcome everyone to the 2K Sports Studios. I'm Greg Gumble, and we're going to bring you our Pontiac game-changing performance. A slam dunk that brings the crowd to its feet, always a fan favorite. The Fresno State Bulldogs slam the door on their opponents with big-time dunks like the one you're seeing here. This is a dunk his teammates will be buzzing about for a while. Look at the fury with which he throws it through the hoop. Thanks, Greg, for Tracy Wilson and Bill Raftery. This is Vern Lundquist saying thanks for joining us for College Hoops on 2K Sports. Great game for both teams on both sides of the ball. But I just love seeing Fresno State showcase his talent like that. But see, this is the things that I be saying. <clears throat> it may look like I've taken the ball and shot it all the time, every time. But look, this is why. 9 for 15, I shot it. But listen, Page, 3 for 7. Terrell Wilson. Two for six. Um, K, uh, K Ball, three for five. Um, Evans Miller. Well, he only shot the ball once. <laughs> Gray, six for nine, seven for twelve, and that will be a topic on the uh podcast this evening. But as you see, we done went out there, we shot the ball. Okay. We did what we were supposed to do. We limited our turnovers to three turnovers. We went out there and played big boy ball. Wow. Don't leave me alone with Myrtle. So they average about 23 points a quarter. That ain't good. They shot the ball 60 times, but only made 19 of those. Wow. Shot the ball from, from beyond the three-point line. 16 times, but only made three of them. Wow, 12 turnovers. Wow. They came, man, and really put in the work tonight. Like I said, on paper, it looks like a blowout, but uh, who knows? But uh, I guess I was right with this one. But uh, that's the end for this stream of this one. And uh, the next game we're going to see is Washington State and Air Force. And then we're going to see... Howard and Loyola Merlin. So, this will be a very great game. This is the game I'm looking for. So, uh, I will see you fellas uh, after this video upload. Peace.